Hey there, this is the new Aries V3, a made in India microcontroller development board based on Tejas 32 SoC. This board is developed by CDAC or Center for Development of Advanced Computing. So in this video, let's see the complete details of this development board and let's see how to program this using Arduino IDE. Let's get started with this video. As I mentioned earlier, this is a 100% made in India product and cheaper than original Arduino Uno. So I got this Aries board in this small cardboard box. After opening, we can see a simple card and the development board. The Aries V3 got the same form factor of Arduino Uno. You can see the Tejas 32 SoC here. This Tejas 32 SoC is powered with Vega ET1031 RISC-V processor. It has 100 MHz clock speed and 256 KB SRAM. The Aries V3 has 2 MB flash, 32 GPIOs, 4 analog inputs, 8 PWM pins, 3 SPI, 2 I2C, 3 UART ports etc. The GPIO pins can deliver up to 12 mA current and the voltage is 3.3. Now we can see the barrel jack here for powering the board. We can use 7 to 12 volt here. Then the USB type C for programming. On the board we can find 3 LEDs. The first one is power LED. This LED is for indicating the status of Tejas 32. And this is a RGB LED which is connected to pin 22, 23 and 24. That's great for debugging. This is the boot selection header pin. We need to change according to the programming mode. So that's all about the hardware and the specifications of this board. Now let's upload code, so I connected the USB cable and you can see the LEDs. The blinking of the yellow LED means the processor is ok and they are calling this as heartbeat LED, nice. Now let's add the board to Arduino IDE, first go to Vega Processor.in and go to development boards and select the Aries V3. Now you can find all details about Aries V3 from here. Now copy the board URL from the getting started menu, then go to Arduino IDE. Go to file, then preferences, then paste the URL here, then click OK. Now go to tools, then board, then board manager, now search for Vega and install the board. After installing you can see the Aries boards in the menu. Now select the board as Aries V3 and select the correct board. In our board the boot selection jumper is there, that means CPU boots from the external flash. So select the flash mode as enabled and programmer as Vega flasher. If the jumper is not connected, then select the flash mode as disabled and programmer as Vega X modem. Now let's upload the LED bling example. Before uploading change the pin to 22 or 23 or 24. Now just upload the code. You can see the LED is blinking, so that's worked. Now let's connect this OLED to Aries. Connect the VCC to 5V, ground to ground, SDA to SDA1 and SCL to SCL1. Now I just uploaded a simple code. Now see the working. You can find the code, board URL and purchase link from the video description. So that's all about today. Hope you enjoyed and learned something new from my video. If so, consider supporting me by liking, sharing and subscribing. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.